Manually searching for leads, checking company sites and copying emails is outdated and exhausting. There's a faster way to do it. In this video, I'll show you how to build and run your own B2B lead generation AI agent step by step. This AI agent automates the entire B2B lead generation process for you. You just fill out a form with your product details, target professionals and location and within minutes, you'll get a clean list of qualified leads with names, designations, contact information, company websites and personalized icebreaker emails. It works like a research assistant that moves 10 times faster. It finds prospects, cleans the data and writes outreach emails automatically. You can just save hours, get verified contact details instantly and scale your outreach without any extra effort. I'm Brand from Website Learners and let's get started. To create a B2B lead generation AI agent, we are going to do six steps. The first step is to download the workflow. To download the workflow, click the link in the description. Now here you can see that we have a ready-made workflow template that you can use to set up instantly without building from scratch. In order to use this template, first we need to have an Enaten hosting. Now there are three different ways you can use Enaten. The first option is to host Enaten locally on your own computer. The first option is free, but it is more complex to set up. The second option is using WebSpace Kit for hosting Enaten. This is the most quickest and the low cost way to host Enaten. This costs just $5 per month or 400 rupees per month. It's easy to use with zero setup required. You also get unlimited workflow executions and unlimited active workflows. The third option is the Enaten Cloud, which is the official platform by Enaten. This costs 24 pounds per month, which is approximately $27. It's much more expensive and the features are limited too. In this video, we're going to purchase an 10 from WebSpace Kit where we get unlimited workflow executions and unlimited active workflows. Since n 10 is open source, you'll get much more benefits when you host it on your own on a platform like WebSpace Kit. Also, WSK provides 100 plus workflow templates for free along with the hosting. So to unlock the workflow template and get the n 10 hosting, just click this workflow. Here, choose how long you want the hosting for. I'm going to choose 12 months. If you choose 24 months, this gives you the best price which is $5 per month. Then fill in these details, enter your payment details and click checkout. So now we have successfully made the payment and we've got our N18 hosting. Now click here and you can see that our plan is active. So let's go to step 2 which is to set up N18. So to set it up, click manage, just scroll down and click go to setup. You fill in these details, click next and it'll take you to this page. This is the place where we are going to create the workflow. We've got our own instance of NA10 on our own URL like you see here. This is completely private for you and only you can use it. Once you reach this page, this means you can now start adding and running your workflows. First, let's download the template. Just go to this tab. Now, if we refresh the page, you can see we are now able to download this template. So just click download and the template file will be downloaded to your computer. Once you have the template, we can go to the next step, which is to import the workflow template. To import the template, go back to N810. Click start from scratch. To import our workflow into N810, click here. Select import from file and upload the workflow file you just downloaded. As you can see here, we've got our workflow. Now we are ready to configure the nodes and connect the required API services to our workflow. So let's go to the fourth step, which is to connect Appify to N810. Now, Appify is a web scraping tool and here we are using it to pull B2B leads from different websites. To connect Appify, let's open this node. To get the API key, click the link in the description and it will take you to this page. Click get started and sign in with your Google account. Now click here. Type in API and click go to API tokens. And here you can see that we've got the API key. So let's copy this. Go back to N18 and paste it here. We have now successfully connected Appify to N18. Now let's go to the fifth step, which is to connect OpenAI to N18. OpenAI is used to format the fetched lead data into clear columns for the Google Sheet. So to connect OpenAI to N18, open this node, click here and select create new credentials. Here we need to enter the API key from OpenAI. To get the API key, click the link given in the description and sign in with your Google account. Now go to API keys and click create new secret key. 
Here, give your key a name. Let's say lead qualify and click create secret key. Here it is. We've got our API key. So let's copy this. Go back to N810 and paste it here. And click save. We have now successfully connected OpenAI to N810. Let's close this. Go back to the canvas. As you can see, we have two more OpenAI nodes to connect them. Just open the nodes one by one and they will be connected to N810. Now let's move on to the sixth step which is to connect Google Sheets to N8N. Google Sheets is where all our lead listings and pitch emails will be stored so that we can access them easily. So to connect Google Sheets to N8N, open this node, click here and select create new credential. Here we need to enter our Google credentials. I've created a separate video that shows exactly how to set up Google Sheets, Google Drive, Google Docs and other Google Apps. You can watch that video and learn how to get the Google credentials. Once you have added the credentials, click here and sign in with your Google account and click continue. Now close this. Now let's create a Google Sheet where the scrape leads will be stored. I've already created a template that you can use directly. To get it, click the Sheets link in the description and it will open this template. So to make a copy of it, click on File. Click Make a Copy. And click the Make a Copy button again. Now let's go back to N8N. We have now successfully connected Google Sheets to N8N. So now we have connected all the required API servers with the N8N workflow and it's ready to run. Just click on Save to store your workflow. Just click Execute Workflow and this form will pop up. Now just enter your search details. In about your product field, enter a short description of your product. For example, I'm going to enter a description of Gravity Right. Next, in the designation field, enter the type of professionals you want to target. I'm going to enter Product Manager. Here enter the region where you want the lead from. Then enter the keyword for your search. It can be topics or technologies related to your product. Next, enter your name and finally here paste your product URL. Once that's done, Click Submit to start the automation. You can see that the workflow has started to run in the background. Once it's done, go to your Google Sheet. And as you can see, we have got a list of leads with their names, designations, contact details, including email and phone number, website URLs, and even a personalized pitch email ready to send. So that's it guys. This is how you can build and run your own B2B lead generation automation using NA10. With this workflow, you can identify relevant prospects, access their contact details, and generate personalized pitch emails without all the manual effort. Now it's your turn. Go ahead and give it a try. The first step is to download the template on WebSpace Kit. And to do that, just click here and it'll take you to the same page that we saw in the first step. So go ahead and start creating workflows. Also, you can get our latest videos directly on WhatsApp. You can just scan the QR or tap the link and hit follow. And that's it. Thanks for watching. Take care. Bye bye.